Okay, hi, good morning everyone. Welcome to this session. So today we are talk so this session we are talking about um the inspection of documents and records kept by company X 2016. Uh by uh, Li Chen. So hi Li Chen. Hi, hi, why why? Good morning. We'll have in terms of uh, inspecting of a company's records. Okay. So what are they? One. What are these documents and records that a company ought to make available for inspection? Okay, who is a person who is entitled? What are the documents that cannot be kept elsewhere but at the registered office only? Then question number four, can the company charge for making copies or take extract? If yes, how much? Yeah, uh, auditors report attached to uh, financial statements or did this report attached to financial statements uh, will be available once it is an auditor's report then uh, it is available by uh, for inspection by members okay then the next is 342 342 talks about um, resolution and minutes of members and details given to company under section 344 okay I bought this because minutes and resolutions of members, uh, as you take note, uh, you need to take note, uh, section 48 sub, uh, 47 sub 2, okay? Section 47 sub 2 has already been amended. It says here, it is tried law that accounting and related records of a company are open for inspection by directors. And this is found under 245 sub 4 of the Companies Act. So that means um, directors will have, directors will have uh, absolute and unrestricted rights to inspect the records, accounting records of a company. Okay. So, okay yeah. This one. May I know, is there any specific minister or any type of minister can grant permission? Uh, Teresa, when uh, minister that we are talking about here is uh, the Minister of Domestic Trade and Consumer Affairs. Or now it's called what? Uh, uh, I don't know whether the still the cooperative and don't know what. The minister in charge of the minister in charge of SSM. Oh, Whenever the KDPKKTPHE are very long one. Let me check. KPDKK. KPDKK.